could not find this Meowth. And there's an Eevee bit later on I tried tracking, couldn't get the Eevee. Did manage to track one Pokemon though, which was uh, pretty annoying. You'll see what happens a little bit later on. But there we go again, gonna capture a lot of Weedles. You're gonna see that a lot in this episode. Just basically Weedles appear everywhere. Unfortunately for me, in my area, Pidgeys and Weedles, especially Weedles, are just absolutely everywhere. But my plan for this episode was basically just to try and hatch a uh, few eggs. But on my travels, I found a Team Instinct gym, represent. I couldn't put a Pokemon in there, so I thought, hey, let's just try to uh, beef it up a little bit. So I jumped in with my Squirtle, not my best Pokemon, because at the time, my best Pokemon were in a gym, uh, defending uh, in a different place. So I thought, let's just train up a little bit, try to take out this uh, Raticate with my uh, little Squirtle. And uh, my Squirtle's starting to kick some butt. I mean, 260 CP. I keep uh, trying to level up. I need to get more Squirtles, though. It's it's so hard to find Squirtles. It really is, but that's one Raticate down. And then we got to fight a Pidgeot. I think there's another Pidgeot after this. But then my uh, my game kind of glitches out and my Squirtle just disappears. That Aqua Jet, it just jetted off into the distance. It's gone forever. So my Squirtle dies against his Pidgeot. And I thought, we'll beef up the gym one more time. Just to help it out a little bit. Because as you all know, I am Team Instinct. And I want to make my gyms uh, as powerful as possible. There's a blue gym down there, which we are going to take this episode. I thought, they can't have a blue gym that close to my uh, my yellow gym. So we're going to have to take it. But this Slowpoke here, uh, Slowpoke right here, i got to say... Look how fast it shoots Water Gun. Like, it does so much damage so quick. I mean, I know it's a higher CP level, but the rate of fire on that Water Gun is absolutely ridiculous. You can just take out Pokemon so fast. I did the mistake trying to use a special attack, so I thought maybe it would do a lot more damage, but if I kept spamming Water Gun like this, I could probably take out everyone. I think I try a special attack here, which does not as much damage. Here, you go, Psy Shock. Doesn't do as much damage. It takes a long time to like, build up. Or you can just keep spamming, uh, spamming Water Gun. So fast, so quick to try and dodge, try and win this battle. But I couldn't do it. That Pidgeot was uh, a bit too strong for me. But that's uh, that's fine. Got a little bit of XP for the gym. Got a little bit of XP for myself. Gym Prestige gained like 320 altogether. So that's not bad. Not bad at all. So we're going to continue our walk. And we are going to now take on this gym. Which is uh, only owned by a Radicate 185. So we're just going to send out... What do I send out? My Squirtle. Yeah, my Squirtle can easily do this because, as you saw, we beat that Raticate in my uh, Team Instinct gym, which we trained up. But nice things. I was praying to get the uh, 1 HP glitch. I think they might have fixed it because I know there was an update for this game very recently. And I haven't um, experienced the 1 HP glitch in a very long time, which is great. And uh, you'll see a bit later on, I took so many more gyms, which is uh, pretty awesome. But that thing's going to try and take me out. But we got it. Just. Just. Live a little bit of HP. Unfortunately, at the time, I didn't have many Pokemon to put in this gym, so I just put my Drowsy in, because I think my Drowsy was like the highest level I had available, because uh, my Pidgeot my Golbat were in a uh, gym somewhere else, so I thought, we'll just put my Drowsy in, and my Fero was dead. So I'm just going to put my Hydro Kids in. I think it's like 354. Three, Pretty decent Drowsy right there. So next what I did is I just uh, caught this Weedle, because <laughs> Weedles are absolutely everywhere. I walked in a circle for like the next five minutes just uh, evolving Pokemon trying to hatch my eggs because I had five minutes of double XP left just in case you don't uh, know if you got double XP on evolve as many Pokemon as you can because you get a thousand XP for each evolution as you can see I'm almost level 16 already got 9,000 XP and we evolved 20 Pokemon got the medal for that got 9,000 XP so that was pretty insane so right right here okay my radar said there's two Squirtles two Squirtles near me I was like, I need to find these Squirtles because I really want to try to get like a water tool at least. Because I need a few more candy. So I started tracking this Squirtle. And I've got to say, it was really embarrassing trying to uh, try to get this. I had my phone up. I had 7% battery left. I was like, I need to find this as fast as possible. So I was walking kind of fast, going through grass, trying to get as close as possible. It goes down to two footsteps. It's like, okay, okay, I need to try to find this. I need to try to find this. And there's people walking their dogs looking at me. So I was just like looking around like I'm, I'm lost. Didn't know where I was going. And, uh... <laughs> Run across this bridge and then it goes back, to, uh, back up to free. I was like, oh god, wrong way, wrong way. So I was going back and forth, back and forth, trying to find this Squirtle. I mean, I really need to, like, I don't know, learn how to track Pokemon better because... I don't know, I, I'm doing it right here. Like, it goes down to one. I'm like, okay, gotta be getting close, gotta be getting close. So I go in this way, but then I just end up going back up. I'm like, oh, nope, turn around, turn around, turn around. Well, don't do it just yet. I'm like, oh, nope, wait, turn, turn, there you go. Then I run back. Then you get some lessons from like Daryl from The Walking Dead or something, just someone who can track. Because 
I suck at tracking Pokemon. I've got to say, I do like this feature, but I just wish it was a bit more easier. Like maybe like it beeps when you get closer. So just saying like, oh, instead of just being like it's within this radius of like 200 feet or whatever, because it's it's kind of hard to find. But looking around, there's my nice Team Instinct gym. But I'm just gonna go to the right. I think let's go across the grass. It's gotta be around here somewhere. And spoiler alert, I do actually end up finding the Squirtle with a few percent battery left. And the sound on this uh, next clip is actually going to disappear. I found out if I get like a notification or anything like that when I'm playing the game, my sound just uh, it just stops, which is really, really annoying. But I was like, Squirtle, Squirtle, got to get this. And this is the most frustrating thing of my life. I was trying to get the Squirtle for the life of me. I had 6% battery left. I, got, I was like, I've got to get this right now because my battery could die at any second because obviously I'm recording and stuff. And uh, I go, let's go Great Ball. Got to try and get this. And the problem with my phone is, when I hit 5% battery, which you'll see in a second, like, you were able to see it on uh, the, screen, the screen right now, but for me, on my phone screen, I lost, like, the backlight of my phone, so I couldn't see a thing, like, it was really dark, it was like playing an original Game Boy, or Game Boy Color, like, in the good old days, where you, like, you had to go, like, at light to properly see the screen, that was like that for me, and I couldn't see a thing, so, like, there you go, 5%, critical, critically low, I was like, oh god, I, could, I couldn't see a thing, so I kept missing my balls, because I couldn't, see where the squirtle was. Gotta be close, gotta be close. Nope. Broke free. Give it a berry so it loves me. It's like, come on squirtle, I need you. I need you so bad. Managed to get this, and I think this is it. It breaks free. I miss because I didn't realize I was gonna curveball right there. I think I opened my bag in a second. Yeah, after this one. Okay, here we go. So throw the ball. It breaks out, I go, screw it, bag. The moment I press my bag, it runs away, and I crash the game. I lost that squirtle. Broke my heart. So I went back home, recharged my phone 100%, I thought I'd go for another little walk, hatched a few of these eggs, found a Psyduck. It's like, wow, that's rare, I didn't find Psyducks around uh, this area before, so I thought I'd just show that. Just got a Psyduck, pretty happy about that. But I thought, hatch these eggs, just walk to the shop again, pick up some milk or something. <laughs> I just literally went to the house, what do you need? Because... I want to go for another walk and actually want to hatch a few eggs. So, I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to hatch three eggs. We get a male Nidoran, which is awesome. Because, again, haven't had that before, so that's a, a lot of XP right there. As you can notice, I lost 5% battery within like a few minutes. This game absolutely drains your battery. Our next egg is a bell sprout, which we already have. Kind of sucks, but yeah, I gotta say when when I'm playing this game and I'm recording at the same time, oh my god, it eats my battery so fast, so fast. But there you go, there's my eggs. I was gonna put this in incubator, but I thought it's only got one egg left. I might as well wait to the uh, I get the in infinite uh, incubator free, which is gonna happen now, so we can just use that, save my uh, paid ones, and bam, we get a magic cup. Which is fine, I don't mind getting Magic Magikarp because I want to get a Gyarados and it takes 400 candy to get a, a Gyarados. That's absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. But that's going to be the end of this episode. I'm starting to walk home right now. The uh, next episode though, I will tell you next episode is going to be really good. Because we're going to hatch a few eggs. I'm not going to spoil anything. We get a pretty decent Pokemon. Because I recorded that this morning. And we're going to take on a lot of gyms. Catch some pretty awesome Pokemon. It is a pretty awesome episode. 